It has been revealed that Sonny has embarked on a new chapter of his life by taking Nina as his wife. Surrounded by their relatives, they exchanged heartfelt vows, creating a truly magical and intimate ceremony. But as is often the case in the tumultuous soap opera universe, happiness may be short-lived. Just as the newlyweds were basking in the glow of their union, a sudden twist of fate emerged. Michael suddenly received a call informing him that Nina was the person who reported to the SEC about the mistake of Carly Spencer and Drew Kane. Michael's expression changed from happiness to anger. We saw his fiery eyes look towards Nina. After learning that she was the one who pushed his mother and drew into the hole. In that poignant moment, it became painfully clear that everything may have already gone awry, casting a dark cloud over their nuptial bliss. Michael decided to return to Port Charles immediately to confirm this information. He called Martin to his office to confirm if it was true that Nina was the accuser after all. At first, the lawyer refused to answer his questions. However, when Michael brought Sonny into the story, Martin admitted that Nina was his client who encouraged him to tell the SEC. It seems that Laura's brother is not exactly a brave man. When Sonny's name was mentioned, he did not hesitate to reveal his client's identity. Nina didn't know that she was being sold out so cheaply. And now, with her newfound status as Sonny's wife, her fate hangs precariously in the balance. In the preview video for the week of October 16 to 20, Sonny wakes up to a call from someone. Viewers could see that his expression became serious, and many assumed that someone would inform him of his wife's true face. Everything could turn into a disaster, and the honeymoon could turn into the most tumultuous event of Sonny's life. What ending do you think is appropriate for Nina's lies?